everybody to another episode of Star Sector. Right, this episode is going to be a little bit different. So I am showing you, basically I'm going to do an overlay. And I'm showing you guys that I have completed the Galactic Academy's quest. So we went, we talked to this lovely lady again in this series. And we got her quest started. Now we shot off and we had some adventures in this episode. So we were looking for uh, petrol. Because I needed petrol. And I needed supplies to get all the way out to where these guys wanted me to go. And basically, yeah. We needed a lot. It was right on the other side of the galaxy. In the last series, it was quite close. And it was really cool because it was like only just a short solar system away. But in this one, we needed heaps. Like we needed 3,000, close to 3,000 to, to do complete all the quests. So, but as you can see, uh, we've got all these dudes quests and we've got to get him up to like happy with us kind of thing. So we did his quests for him and we also had a look uh at doing like a little side quest and you'll see why i didn't do that <laughs> it was a wee problem uh but here's us burning across the solar system all the way over to a funnel and we sped through the funnel and we came all the way all the way all the way to here right and it took ages so we came into here and we did a few quests in here but when we started to go over here there was a couple of things one right there you'll see that there's a cryo something or other and uh there's a big bad boss in there so i, I didn't want to tackle with that but then we had the ludic path and they came along and they said hey you need to give us the stuff or we're gonna we're gonna take it from you and i said bring it on because i'm pretty sure and confident that i can beat you guys so i loaded up all my all my eradicators no eradicators yeah eradicators and my eagles and i took off i also had that tiny little dude <laughs> so we tried our best and uh, you'll see in this next lot of b-roll that we actually did quite well we lost one ship and that was just because i was being really lazy and i wasn't uh i wasn't focusing on it as you can see it's me in that one i'm pretty sure it's me in that one so i was just being really really lazy so this this one was really aggressive this lady and she like kicked my butt for that one yeah there we go so but i got her back and i got her stuff and just remember little dude popped up remember to subscribe uh so we were in here and we smashed through some of their forces and then they started to split out and I was thinking to myself, now this is about the time that I get a little bit click happy and I start clicking on things and then everything goes wrong. So what I did was I just let them do their own thing and they actually did really well. And you can see that my little tiny ship on the left hand side there is just kiting that ship and keeping it out of the way of the big boys until they decided to come over and destroy it so that was quite cool and i have now got two of those tiny little ships so we'll see how that goes in the next episode now we continued and we started to do another lot of quests so we had this one that we had to go up and we had to colonize a planet or perform a survey on a planet sorry i thought it was colonized and it had scattered runes so we explored those runes we opened a pod and we didn't really get much from it it was it was a pretty bad rune. so we left that place and we headed all the way down here now this place i didn't see the red beacon that's flashing there i was just like hey there's a planet in here that they want us to you know uh survey and we popped in now i didn't realize it's full of these dudes <laughs> so it wasn't the best but I do have a really good battle for you to watch and I will let you watch it now. I'll speed it up a tiny bit as well, but yeah, it is a quite a good battle and I do win this one, but the next one, not so much, but yeah, critique it. I use a bit of defense. I, I let them do their own thing and I do take them out. So enjoy.
So as you can see, I did win and I did get a lot of loot, which was pretty cool. But as you can see on the left hand side, there is something heading towards me <laughs> and I try and burn away from it, which is quite cool. I do do a very good, oh, and that one, I forgot about that. I do do a very good burn, but where is it? Where is it? Here it comes. Oh, where is it? I thought it was here. No, that's right. I went to the nav beacon because I was like, if I can bring this online, I'll get burn speed. <laughs> and then these guys smash me. That big ship is a beast and I'm not ready to take those on. So I try and send the little dude around to capture the points and I send my group up and I try and defend a point. It, it doesn't work. It doesn't do very well. And we we learned from it put it that way we we learned a lot and we learned not to tackle with those guys just yet because we didn't have the firepower all the smarts but yeah we'll see So what we do is we restart and we head back to the Galactic Academy. We complete all the quests that they gave us and we get the new one, which is Lady gives us uh, a quest and we head off in that direction. And we also get hit by a storm, but that's OK. We head off in that direction and we are finding. Actually, I can't remember what's in this. What's in this direction? Oh, that's right. We're coming over to the Luddock Path because they need to tell me something. That's totally fine. We finished this quest and there was a massive story on that. I didn't want to put that in because that was just way too much. Oh, this is funny. So I thought while I was out here, I'd do some exploring, see if I could find some really good loot. And I thought, you know, there's always something by a black hole, you know, a research station, something like that. So I came for a look and there was there was a bit of a problem because I, as you can see, I got stuck in the black hole. <laughs> Uh, but I managed to get out of it and I found a research station which was cool so we managed to get a bit of stuff out of that lovely now we do get attacked by a pirate on the way back and I have kept this battle in there I will speed it up a bit but I have kept that battle in there because I actually do really well uh I do a lot of defending and I let my fleet destroy them and I was victorious and the pirates fled and I chased them and all that but it's very cool they just take them all out it's awesome we then go back and we hand in the quests and we get new quests and off we go we head off that's just such a long quest line i mean ridiculously long so so it was a long way down here we get a couple of storms and we basically are heading there we're nearly getting there and i think to myself huh i didn't know that there was pirates along the way. I thought I missed them, which was those ones. And then these guys, boom, they got into me. And I thought, why not? I'll give them a go. I'm pretty confident that I'm going to be able to take them out. There was quite a lot of them, quite a little ships, quite a little ships. That's good English. Uh, quite a lot of little ships, but I managed to smash them. So enjoy the battle and let me know if I could do anything better. You guys will like this so basically i'm cruising along doing these quests and we come up and we go cool we're doing this quest lovely done but then what happens is i get a message saying that there's there's pirates heading towards my colony cola alpha and yeah i was like what am i gonna do i, I don't know what what was that it popped up made a funny noise and so I don't know how I found it, but I found it in Intel and it tells me everything about my colony and what the crisis is. So we head up there and we are going to 
try and help them out because I wanted to see what was going on. So in the middle of doing these quests, I shot up there and we helped out the colony and we also got there to do some quests along the way. I think there was two, two along the way, which is good. Uh, but we got up to uh, Alpha Cola and we added some stuff to our colony. So I put some money in that we'd already just got. Uh, we got some, uh, what was it? Uh, HQ, I think it was. And we got, yeah, yeah, yeah. So we, we put a couple of story points into our colony, which helped it. We also made an HQ and we also, which gives us patrol fleets. And then while that was building, the pirates turned up, which is uh, these guys. And I was able to take them out pretty quick smart. I won't show you that video because it's exactly the same as the other other pirates. And then we sat there for a little bit because it was going to take 60 days. And we we basically like just sat there, had a chat and yeah, we just we just did some cool things. And then the HQ was finished and basically we praised, praised the HQ because it popped out a fleet and then pirates turned up again <laughs> funny that and they uh and my hq fleet took them out so i added another story point on the hq fleet because that made it pop out another one and then this dude turns up so this dude is a lot of path and he was like oh hey i want you to give me some of your supplies and he had really big ships so i was like yeah hey, sure not a problem you can have some of my supplies all good uh i think in the first one i said to him don't have enough supplies and he was like yeah no no worries you i don't want to take from people who are poor or something like that we'll let you go and so he let me go and then when i got supplies he came back and he was like yo hey give me some supplies and so i gave him the supplies because 125 supplies all my life was uh, a little bit easier than losing my fleet so i did that and as you can see it's a massive fleet that he's got and I thought I'm not going to be able to take that on. So, and I want to stay friendly with those guys because they seem to be one of those ones that seem to have ridiculously big fleets. So, yep, we did that. We looked after Alpha Cola and then we headed home and we basically handed on our quests and we were up to the quest that I needed for last series. And that was what we were doing before I ended last series. So I thought, well, I'll speed this along for you guys and we will basically just get up and running. And then next episode, I will record a whole new uh, runaround of the Ziggurat quest, I think it is. So that was where I was up to. And um, yeah, we uh, will take you along for the ride and we'll see what it does. Cause I haven't done the quests before. So I was just basically completing all these so we could get back up, do it really fast and then we can carry on but yeah you guys have a good rest of your night uh, i appreciate you guys coming along for the ride we are at 235 subs at the time of this recording and i'm really appreciative of that so if you're not subbed and you want to come along for the journey click the sub button it's free and you can just be notified if you want to or you don't need to be notified whatever you want but everything helps and i appreciate you if you did i appreciate it if you didn't if you're just here watching and i appreciate you so okay you guys have a good rest of your night i will see you in the next video and yeah stay cool that sounds like squirt stay cool squirt yeah new zealand show some people will get it some people won't uh right see you later bye